You're up early. Sorry, I thought you were awake. So did I. <laughs> you feeling all right? Yeah, yeah. No, I'm, I'm fine. Okay. Well, um, how about I make some coffee? Huh? Well, thanks. Yeah. But it's getting worse now. It's getting so I can only sleep a few minutes at a time. They released him early. He's out? I saw him last week coming out of Cuddy's. And that's when the nightmares started again. I'm thinking about buying a gun. Are you sure that's a good idea? To be honest, that's my next stop. What do you plan to do with this gun? Well, I've never used one before, so I'm a little nervous about what kind to get. Is it for protection? or revenge. Deb? Sorry. It's nothing. You can go back to sleep. some nightmares, but... About what? She doesn't like to say, but best I can figure, she's being chased around town. What? That's why she said it. Said what? She said she won't be free until he's dead. Who? She never told you? About what? About how he used to beat her. Who? your gun out? No, I, listen, Denise, I can't explain it, but there's something very therapeutic about being the one in total control. I was the one who was going to decide what would happen and whether he lived or died. And I just stood there watching him. And God, it felt so good. For the first time in my life, I wasn't afraid of him. And that was enough, so... I just walked away. He never even knew I was there. Grant? Oh, Jesus. Oh my God, what happened? I was downtown and these guys jumped me and they, they pulled out a knife. Okay. Grant, this is a bad cut. I, I'm calling the police. No. No police and no hospitals. Oh, for Christ's sakes. Don't answer it. Why not? Okay. Please. Don't go away. Don't worry. I'll get rid of them. Mrs. Stanley? Yes? Um, may I come in? A man was murdered about an hour ago. His name was Jack Hayes. Your address was scribbled on an old envelope in his wallet. Mrs. Stanley, are you bleeding? Oh. The damn knife slipped while I was cutting vegetables. Do you need stitches? Are you okay? Mm, it's this dull knife. You know what they say. Let me take a look at your finger. That is a good one, but you'll live. Like I was saying, his name was Jack Haynes, and I was wondering if you knew him. He 
was my father. Did he have any enemies? <laughs> you mean besides everyone he ever met? One of those people, huh? Anyways, let me help you get this cleaned up. No, that's okay. I'll Come take on. care of it. Protect, serve, and bandage. Where do you keep your band-aids? Uh, uh, Detective Horn, I keep the bandages in the kitchen. Victor 14, Victor 14, this is Victor 42. Go for 13. We're going to need you down back at the station. All right, I'm on my way. ETA 10 minutes. I'm sorry about your father.